Ruffles Farm to market, uh, so we decided we needed to come in to have a market here. Uh, we built the metal structure out here as a big carrot for these produce vendors so they wouldn't have to do tents as they work so hard getting up in the morning, bringing this produce out and picking nice. it in the field. And that was the start of it. We met them from a few, and uh, now we've got a lot more. We've got more coming next weekend. This is the second week of the market. It's going to be every Saturday of the year, uh, rain or shine, and uh, we hope you all come out and join us. Thank you. I, I think it's a great event. We've got about 50 varieties of herbs. So we try to grow everything naturally, um, hope that you can come up and taste anything put in your mouth. We don't use insecticides. And we're just real happy to offer you fresh, wonderful herbs to uh, just enhance everything. Hello, I'm Mike Morrison and this is a great thing for downtown and for New Braunfels. This is my second week in a row, came out in the rain last week. And uh, had as much fun and had as many people last time as this week. Uh -huh. uh, great, 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 great activity. And you, I see you've got a, some bags there. What are you buying today, oh, Mike? See, we got onions and I think goat cheese and coffee. We got a couple of portobello mushrooms. So we're all set for dinner tonight. Barkley Family Farm. And then our strawberries are grown at our farm hydroponically. Hydroponic. Hydroponic. It just means you're growing without dirt. It's a you pick it farm. Yes. So come on out. Come on out anytime. Tuesdays through Saturdays from 10 to 5 30. Great. My name is Robert Regals from Regals Egan Hop right here in New Braunfels. This is such a, a boost to the downtown. It's great for the people in the Braunfels. They can get fresh products. Um, it is, it's just, it's a win-win situation for the citizens and for the local farm. We have fresh goat cheese from our farm here in New Braunfels. We mount the goats by hand, we make the cheeses by hand, and 95% of the greens that go into my cheeses are grown in my farm.